As major cities in the country continue to grapple with the challenges and scarcity of premium motor spirit PMS, also known as petrol, due to the importation of contaminated products recently, the Nigerian Defense Headquarters says troops of Operation Data Save have within the last two weeks discovered a total of 38 illegal refining sites, 100 metal storage tanks and other materials used for illegal refining of petroleum products within the Niger Delta region of the country. Director of Defense Media Operations, Major General Ben Adonyeoko, who stated this during the bi-weekly media briefing in Abuja, said the Nigerian military and other sister agencies are committed to making sure that the country is safe of illegal refining activities and other dangerous outcomes it brings to the lives of Nigerians. The ongoing operation in Delta safe to curb the nation of economic saboteurs is still ongoing. The troops conducted several clearance operations in different locations. Troops within the period under review recovered a, lot of, a total of 1,118,175 liters of automotive gas oil, 2,086,000 liters of stolen crude oil. Similarly, troops recovered, discovered that eight refining sites, 100 metal storage tanks, 25 dugout pits, 75 cooking ovens, 20 cotonou boats, 35 ya Yamaha pumping machines, 18 coolants, as well as 10 tankers we are recovered. Giving update on operation within the northeast region of the country, Major General Onyeoko said troops of Operation Harding Kai within the period under review carried out a series of attacks and counter-attacks which led to the surrendering of notable criminals. Own troops operational activities was conducted in Bama, Mafa, Dikwa, Gamboru, Banking Junction and Kondugawa in Borno State. This led to the surrendering of 466 Boko Haram and Islamic State of West African province, terrorists and their families, comprising of 120 adult males, 137 adult females, and 209 children, with the claim that they have lost interest in the Boko Haram terrorist ideology. The military high command, while commending the troops for the feat recorded, also used the medium to call on Nigerians to give useful information that will help the military to record success in the fight against terrorism and other forms of crimes in the country.